In the heat of summer, we are reminded of this alarming statistic state and local leaders say is completely preventable. Florida leads the country in deaths when, with children who are left in hot cars. Yeah, we've had six child deaths so far this year. News 6's James Barbero is in Titusville, where a new awareness campaign is kicking off at a gas station. The first sticker on the first pump. Florida's Agriculture Commissioner placing the first sticker on a gas pump in the state, reading, never leave children or pets in a hot vehicle. Our children, our pets are very vulnerable this time of year. In the nation this year, we've had 15 deaths already, six in the state of Florida. Commissioner Wilton Simpson says the new campaign This is about constant reminders. was Brevard County Sheriff Wayne Ivey's idea. One of the state's child deaths this year happened in Palm Bay, where police say a mother left her baby in the parking lot of Mount of Olives Evangelical Baptist Church. Police say manslaughter suspect and pastor Bouline Molme left her daughter in the car for hours as she led service. 1099 on an 11 month old. 11 month old infant. We're attempting to give CPR instructions. Since 2016, Florida law has protected those who break someone's window to rescue a person or an animal from a hot car. As you can see, it's automatically telling me the temperature is 88. Like other law enforcement canine vehicles, Sheriff Ivy shows us how his car for his bloodhound Junie can automatically open windows if the temperature gets too hot. Police blamed mechanical failure two years ago when a Coco canine died. Police say former officer Vieira Gonzalez left Zena in his car as he attended hours of training. Our team makes sure that they're not leaving the dog in the car for extended periods of time. Starting with the BP in Titusville, the Agriculture Commissioner says eventually this sticker will be on every gas pump in the state of Florida. In Brevard County, I'm James Sparvero, getting results news 6.